It's time for the June Bug Story with Bruce. The Big Star. Forget about AB. Yeah, I'm on TV right now, baby. <laughs> on TV right now, baby. <laughs> she told me to fuck off. She said she loved it like that. But anyway, I, anyway, anyway, I'm back to a story here. I invented this situation. The other night I was at a local cafe. It was deep in the heart of Salina. And... You did right. change the story a bit. <laughs> no, but watch this. Okay. I met. There was four guys sitting at the table, man, and we was all sitting around talking about how it was going to go down. And all of a sudden, I seen this thing fly in, and it was a big old, big old green bug. It looked like a June bug. But, hey, I always thought the June bugs were brown, right? But this one was big and green, and all of a sudden, it zoomed in and landed down, right? Well, this I see, the bug. that's the June bug. Okay. I seen a beetle. He went running, a little Does black. He, he, did, he is the only one of the things that do this shit. But anyway, he was running across the ground like that. So I just went across and I snatched them both up and threw them in my drink like that. Wow. <laughs> and they were floaters. They were floating around just like that. So I took the guy to over there at the table over there. There was four of them. I got witnesses. I got witnesses. <laughs> now check it out. I said, if I had a kid of spray paint, I spray paint that one yellow and that one white. You can see they stand out in black, right? So you can see them good. So then, I said, well, I'm going to put them out here and I'm going to let them run around. Hey, check it out. It's like, you know, you're playing God now. You're going to give first breath, right? Well, you bring them out. You know, lay them down like that. They're waterlogged. And then you just still didn't have enough. It's still alcohol abuse. You still want to waste so you do it like this. You're drowning them a little more. Now, I know why you didn't get up. Well, pretty soon, here comes two little, two little brown June bugs, little babies. And they were just out here running around. They, they were navigating. They could move, they could do what they want. But my two little buddies, I didn't get a chance to paint them. They wouldn't let me go get spray paint. I didn't get her done. <laughs> but anyway, they knew which one was mine. I said the black beetle. Not the green boy. And the green boy was sitting over here on his back. I tried to stand him up, but it just wouldn't work. So, and Blackie was sitting there like that, and he was resting it out. And then pretty yeah. soon, and then pretty soon I, pretty soon I seen him, he went in a lot, little movement like this. It, it was really navigational. Hey, and the only reason why I knew he moved is, is when he did this, watch. <laughs> when he did this, watch. <laughs> <It's laughs> when, right. when he did it's that, I knew that right. was I knew that wasn't there. <laughs> so then, pretty soon, Jose Brucey. he got to navigate, and, and he was going like this, watch. And then, not not like a speedboat, but he was a little slower than that. <laughs> and then we, and then pretty soon he got out. And I think he, I was rooting and I was telling my buddies, I said, check it out, man, I'm gonna win, I'm gonna win. They said, it ain't over yet. And then when he got out of the water, man, he was laying tracks. See, everywhere he goes, he would lay a track. You see? He's, <laughs> he's drawing a line. Hey, well, anyway, I don't know what got him wound up, but for some reason, he, he just, he just, no, it's not funny, man, because I, I was pitching the bitch about this one. Sorry about my language, but oh, wow. the sucker, he would just keep going back. He would keep going back to the water, dude. He keep going back to the water, and, uh, and I'm trying to tell him, get out of there, man. I'm trying to win. Because me and my buddies over got a bet on him, right? $10. Dollars. And then he's in there floating around again like a dummy. No, I'm, I'm pissed off with that bug. That bug is fucking me up here. I'm talking to the guys over here. They knew I wanted to win. So first thing, here comes the beetle again, and he drags out. See, and he just keeps on making a pretty ass picture. So then pretty soon, I say, <laughs> I'm over here blowing on that bitch. <laughs> Dry off quick. No, I ain't, <laughs> I ain't on the ground, I ain't praying, but you know what I'm saying. I, I my, hear you, brother. In my mind, dry off fast, man. Just in your away. mind. And then, 
and then that's he, a scary place. And he's done that enough. Anyway, we got to go to a new one because that one's not drying out. <laughs> that is really wet. It must be. But anyway, he got a done. A really scary place he, to be inside. He, got, he finally got done. <laughs> he finally got done, and he was out here running around. Yeah. He was doing his happy freedom, and that green beetle. Be- happy freedom. And that, yeah, and that green beetle would never move from that spot. You know what? I think he drowned it when he got in there. I think as soon as he got, he got he got too much alcohol, he didn't snap out of it. He got alcohol. He didn't snap out of it. He got alcohol poisoning. As soon as he hit it, he I think he got drunk. <laughs> and I didn't wait to see if he was gonna wake up. But me and my buddies, I rooted and I won. And the only one was still running around the farm when I left was the little two small beetles. Okay. That one, George and his little friend. George? <laughs> they were, <laughs> they were running. <laughs> hey, and my buddy uh, said, I done came out, I done won. You're still there. And then he's running back, and he's back through the water again. <laughs> <laughs> now, now tell, tell us about Chris. Chips up. Yeah, where's Chris? I need to talk to my girlfriend. When you come back and playing with daddy, baby. <laughs> uh, you know, I'm here for you. <laughs> hey. Chris, Chris uh-huh. says you're going to die in a bar. Yeah, well, you make my day. Hey, well, this is what I do for you, Chris. <laughs> come, says, come get some of this. <laughs> he, says, he says you're nothing but an old drunk, and they're going to put you in the trash can. All right, well, I got one for you. Come for this. This is for you, and this is for you. <laughs> don't play with the Statue of Liberty. They know how to win. <laughs> you don't. Well, statue and you don't have to be in New York. <laughs> hey, so when are you coming down to see me, girlfriend? <laughs> <laughs> hey, they tell me the reason why you ran out of town was your buns were hot. Yeah. Pretty much. I can talk to Chris like that. What, what about cage fighting? Are you going to fight him in the cage? Well, that little bitch couldn't handle an action like this. <laughs> I'd even wear a muscle burrow. <laughs> <laughs> what, what do you think of Muhammad Ali? Would you fight Muhammad Ali in the cage? That'd be like Chris. I'd still be floating like a butterfly, stinging like a bee. They'd be wondering why they bring it on and why they act like me. <laughs> <laughs> hey, so, uh, can't you see? <laughs> You, you got anything to say to all your fans on YouTube? Yeah, yeah, I think they like me by now. <laughs> I think they're waiting for me to die. <laughs> Somebody want the inheritance. <laughs> but inherit your videos <laughs> on YouTube. The, the inheritance. But they don't understand. I'm going to be here for the next 20 years. Now, it's going to be me in the videos. <laughs> now, Chris is always calling Larry gay. You'll let him talk to you like that? I'd stand up and kick his little bitch ass and show him who's the man in the house. <laughs> yeah, show him who's the man in the house. I'd kick his ass. So fuck you, bitch. <laughs> Don't bother me, boy. <laughs> this ain't live, is it? Yeah, I don't want to piss I don't want to piss off the universe. Just a little bit. <laughs> yeah, more stories for us. Come on. Give us a good story. Oh, a good one? Give us a good story. Okay, okay, okay. What, what about, t- tell us about the story of the night that you ran the cowboy out of town. Remember the cowboy? Cowboy was a good guy. You ran the cowboy out of town. Yeah, yeah. I, met him, I met him in a local cafe. In a local cafe. <laughs> local cafe, and he's pitching a little bitch and was trying to tell me that he was something that I knew he wasn't. So I said, hey, well, I'm a rock star, dude. I'm going over across the street and be on TV. So... I said, come on over. I said, come on over to see me. So he's he's wanting to argue at me for where I got across the street. So finally all of a sudden I seen that white ass cowboy hat and I knew that was that little faggot. So he showed up, pulling out his little bitch scene. He didn't show me how to dance on the dance floor. Shit. I danced with Jimmy Buffett. George Strait. <laughs> You dance with Jimmy Buffett and George Strait? Alan Jackson. The BBBs. Shania loves me. Shania loves you? Yeah, I 
was my girlfriend was uh